Let's take the drawers out of this Nordly. Everyone, welcome back to the Clueless Dad. A real quick video just to show you how to take drawers off on the Nordly system. So this is actually like two Nordly drawers stacked on each other, so six drawers. Uh, the trick to getting these things out is there's a plastic clip here that you have to pull forward. You can either use your fingers or a screwdriver. So yeah, you just want to get this plastic tab and either pull it from the sides. There's actually little ribs, so it's not that hard. Or get the screwdriver in the slotted part here and pull it forward. Surprisingly easy once you know what to do. Uh, before I figured it out, I was like trying to yank it and I was afraid that I was going to break something. So yeah, just lift up and it comes out. I'm actually going to be moving this thing downstairs to my new apartment and I wanted to take the drawers out just to make it lighter. Let me try it with my fingers again. There we go. Not even that hard. You just got to know what to do. So don't try yanking it out without pulling those white plastic tabs forward. Okay, let's get the second one. This one actually has stuff in it, so I gotta be a little bit more careful. And I would support these things on the bottom if they're really full. So for the Nordly, uh, this is all one assembly, and the drawer basically just hooks in. This goes into the hole in the back of the drawer, and this goes into a hole, and then it gets locked in with that plastic slider. So that's what you're actually locking into, and then this thing goes in. So it's not like the other like on the Billy bookcase and other things like that where basically it goes into a track with wheels. In this case, these things stay together and if you push it all the way back, it locks in place. And so when you want to put these things back in, basically pull them all the way out, lay it down here, slide this part till it goes in the hole. So you might want to hold it as you slide the thing back. And then once this is in place and in there, slide the white plastic back on. So let me demonstrate one. So it's a little bit tricky. You gotta kinda lay it in there, get it lined up. And then the problem is once you put the weight on, this thing is gonna start sliding. So you've gotta basically pull it forward, get this in place. And yeah, you can see once I get them both in. Almost there. Okay, there we go. So now this thing is dropped in place and this one there we go. So now they're both in and they're in this hole and then I just slide that guy back. Okay, so if you've got this thing locked in, should close and open just like new. This drawer was actually further down originally, but it fits once you get it in. That's basically it. Just quick note, I've had this thing for two years. It's pretty much in perfect shape. The only, I guess, complaint might be that I never got all the drawers to be super flush and perfect, but nobody cares. Um, so quality wise, everything else seems to hold up just fine. Fits a lot of stuff. So yeah, that's it for today. See you guys next time. Bye.